lose weight or no baby, ultimatum. My, 32F, husband, 33M, together 15 years, has given me an ultimatum of, show me you are dedicated to losing weight and we can have another baby. I've steadily been gaining weight since leaving high school and have plateaued at 250 pounds, 5 feet 6 inches height. It took us almost 3 years to get pregnant, and the end of my pregnancy had a health scare due to preeclampsia. But up until my daughter was born, I was diligent about only gaining the minimum amount of weight and we had a healthy baby. Now we want another baby but he is demanding I try to lose weight so we don't have another health scare. I already have super low self-esteem and getting an ultimatum like this just feels so defeating. To be honest losing weight has been the hardest thing I've ever had to do. How should I respond? I'm afraid this may break our marriage if we can't see eye to eye, stop arguing about it. I don't know what to say about your husband's ultimatum, so I'll share what I learned in my OB rotation in nursing school. I wrote a paper on maternal fetal mortality in obese populations for a certificate in community health. Being obese is one of the strongest predictors of mortality for mothers and infants. It's three times more deadly for an obese woman to have a child. You have a BMI of 40. A BMI over 40 is considered morbidly obese. If you want to do some googling, searching for maternal fetal mortality plus obesity will give you dozens of academic papers on this subject. I've added two papers that I personally cited in my paper. Dot. I think the ultimatum is fair even if it hurts your feelings. He doesn't want to risk you for possibly another baby. That seems extremely valid and rational even if it hurts your feelings of wanting another child. If it leads to you guys separating it sucks, but I see his pov and yours. It might be one of the hardest things for you to lose weight but it would probably be a lot harder if he lost you while you were pregnant with your kid. He doesn't want to be a single parent to two kids and a widower in his mid-thirties, and he wants to try to avoid you getting preeclampsia again, which would put you on bed rest and him as sole caretaker for you, your daughter, the house, and his job, so he wants you in decent health before adding the stress of another pregnancy on your body, and that is fair and reasonable. It's honestly a bit selfish on your part to ask him to help you endanger your health. He's not saying you aren't attractive to him, he is purely focused on your health because he fucking loves you. Appreciate that you have a husband who wants you to be around the rest of his life and thus won't take unnecessary risks with your health. Your self-esteem isn't the most important thing here. You want to risk your life by getting pregnant again, eclampsia and gestational diabetes, and leaving your first baby with no mother. Being obese also makes you tired. Being a mother is hard, and a mum of two is more than two times as hard because you don't get the rests at sleep time which you do with only one baby. Who picks up the slack when you can't cope? You should make an effort to lose weight, honestly. Being pregnant while obese can cause a myriad of health problems for both you and the baby, it's much more risky than if you are at a healthy weight. He is raising valid concerns. It's not about your looks, it's about your health. This may be a tough love moment he is trying to give you. I am sure he doesn't want to see anything happen to you and wants the best for you. The two of you should go have a frank talk about your weight and how it will affect your changes of conceiving and yours baby's health with your OBGYN. This isn't a dude being an ass because he expects his wife to stay the same size as she was when she was a junior in high school, though there is nothing wrong with doing that if that is the woman's choice and she is healthy, but this is not having something bad happen to you or the baby. I think the way he said it sounds dumb, but seems like his heart is in the right place. I would say that it may be a good idea for both of you to focus on the process rather than the goal. Does he have to lose weight as well? You could both work on it. Being someone who's overweight, I can empathize with the self-esteem issues. But trust me finding a buddy will help make the process easier and fun. I was prepared to be on your side here, but after reading, I mildly agree with your husband. I don't believe that he is coming from a place of malice. You're going to gain more weight when you're pregnant, and this could put you at risk for a plethora of health issues. Generally, pregnancies go smoother when you're at a healthier weight. You are morbidly obese. I'm not saying this to hurt you, but a BMI of 40 is heavily obese. Getting pregnant is not only putting you and the baby at risk, but also your husband of being a widower with a child. That whole situation could be avoided by losing weight. If losing weight for you is hard, raising two children should be out of the question because that also takes discipline, responsibility and commitment. And if you can't provide these things for yourself, you can't provide them for somebody else. It is harsh, but he is right. 
your body just is not in very good shape to carry a baby and he does not want to lose you and end up a single father. Or to lose you and the child. It is really difficult to not take personally and to feel like it is because you're suddenly unattractive, but he does seem genuine in his concern for your health and the health of the baby. In nursing school this girl told us a story about her friend who has severe preeclampsia, which caused a massive stroke that left her paralyzed and unable to care for herself. And this girl was young. Pregnancy is no joke it can be deadly or leave you permanently impaired even if you're young and healthy. It might hurt your feelings but you know he's right. 250 at 5, 6 is not healthy. Husband has a very valid point. Sucks to hear, but we have to be honest with the ones we love. Don't let it break your marriage. You love each other and you have a family. It sounds like he's concerned for your health and maybe isn't fully vocalizing that part. You need to express to him that it hurts your feelings while also understand it from his side too. I wish you both the best. An ultimatum wasn't the right thing to say to you about this situation. It is done because he wants to have a healthy pregnancy without worrying if he'll lose you. I'm doing this now but I'm not doing it alone. I have a therapist and a dietitian that I work with weekly in order to help get my weight down and repair my self-esteem. He's worried about you dying because yeah you are morbidly obese your heart is in trouble. This sounds like he's not doing it out of vanity but legitimate fear of losing you or the baby because of health complications due to your weight. 250 pounds is large and unhealthy for you and you need to admit that to yourself. Again do not start losing weight for vanity do it to increase you lifespan and overall life qualify for yourself so that you can see your kids grow and have children of their own. He wants you to lose weight because he wants you and a potential baby to be healthy. He has a point. Drop the weight. It takes a lifestyle change. Something about your routine has to change permanently. Dot. To lose weight you should do CICO, basically calories in calories out. For example if you aim for a 1300 calories a day to lose weight, google the amount of calories each meal has and add it up to fit your budget. For example a Big Mac meal is 1100 calories which almost takes up your entire day's calories. An hour's walk will burn 300 calories. Some support subreddits, r, lose it r, c i c o. As much as society wants to make being obese normal, it's not healthy. Fat shaming is not okay, and not everyone needs to look like a model, but medically speaking at 5, 6 and 250 you are morbidly obese. Reddit and I don't know you and your husband's whole story, but I suspect part of his concern is for you and your child and future children and not just looks as you're at a much elevated risk for diabetes, heart disease etc. He's proposing a wise compromise. Otherwise it'd be unsafe for the baby. Ultimatums suck and I wouldn't normally take his side in a situation like this but you're at serious health risk. Who cares about the ultimatum or another baby? Your health should be number one priority right now. I already have super low self-esteem and getting an ultimatum like this just feels so defeating. Victim narrative. Brutal honesty versus sugar-coated lie, which one do you people think is better? I was like oh what's 250 pounds in kilogram? Turns out if you are the same weight as my grown father who is 5 feet 11 who bears the exact same weight, there is no beating around the bush. This is not a matter of aesthetics that your husband is talking about, but genuinely your health as there's no way to justify being that weight where a pregnancy will have no hazards. Think of it this way, he loves you more than his desire to have another child. He's willing to lose the family he cherishes in a divorce instead of risking you dying. Lady, Considering all the posts here about men who put their own selfish wants over their partner's needs, you're lucky as hell to have someone who is only fighting with you because he has your best interests at heart. Give that man a hug, then lose some weight and welcome the new addition to your happy family together. How is your husband's weight? Is losing weight or in general improving your fitness something you can do together? Sharing a goal like that can really help you achieve it. As for the, ultimatum, it does sound like it comes from a place of concern. Best of luck to you both. As mentioned previously it is a hard truth and it sounds like your husband is truly concerned for you, your health and the health of your future child. I think when you say an ultimatum is defeating is pathetic, it's like you're already given up and attempting to get acceptance which is a bad we shouldn't ever accept fat people especially ones too lazy to lose weight and you're trying to make us gang up on her husband when he's saying clear as day what he wants and expects from his wife. Are you proud to be fat in front of her child? 
What kind of mom is complaining on Reddit when you should be doing research on dieting? If you seriously cared you'd use that motivation to do something of the sort, I suggest keto. And another thing l don't think fat people should be allowed to have kids if they can't learn a balanced diet like seriously what kind of role model for your family and kid is that? The average weight of WWE champions are 240 pounds and 6, 2. I have to say that the health scare thing would motivate me. I struggle with weight but if and keto has made it so much easier. Being healthy before pregnancy, i.e. eating well, plenty of nutrients actually has a huge effect on the baby's growth and brain development, so if you think about it that way, eating well beforehand makes sense. Being healthy and being a healthy weight will help you with child care and being able to do more things with your children, playing and being active. You could look into some help with self-esteem often has an effect on your belief that you have the ability to be successful. Don't do this by yourself. Join a group online if necessary. Having people support you and celebrate the small changes can be very helpful. You should respond by losing weight. I know that it is hard, but it is worth it. Hi. Looks like everyone has mentioned the health concerns already so I'll just say this. I recently lost 30 pounds in 2 months and I'm still going. I'm now training to be a PT and neutral coach in my spare time. I know how hard it can be but if you'd like, I can share my food plan, workouts and routine. I'm also happy to check in with you weekly to help you lose weight if you need support. I'm based in Asia but if you want, we could arrange Zoom workouts for you and your husband together, no charge. It won't be easy but it will be totally worth it. More than happy to help. I don't have anything to add to this topic, but I want to thank people that commented. I myself am a short woman on a chubby side and me and my spouse were thinking to try and have a baby this year. And reading this topic made me realize that I should start living a more healthy lifestyle now, so that we would have our best chances in a healthy baby. Thank you, everyone. Since you've already received solid advice here's a different two cents, have you had your thyroid checked? Or been checked for PCOS? Those can contribute to weight gain and make it harder to lose weight. I feel like he's doing this for your own good, even though it's a bit harsh. If he'd said it in another context then we'd all be jumping on him being an asshole, but having a baby at your weight is very dangerous and he doesn't want you and him to have to deal with that. I think he is really scared to go through the same experience again so he just wants to ensure you will take it seriously and try hard to lose weight so that's why the ultimatum. Usually I don't like ultimatums like that, but in this case, I get where he's coming from. He already almost lost you and your baby, it's traumatic to him too. Obviously he loves you if he wants a family with you and is attracted to you if he wants to put another baby in you, he just doesn't want to risk you dying and him staying behind, widowed and with two young children, which I think is fair. Lose the weight. Trust me. Do not end up in a cycle of weight gain pregnancy weight gain. My 130 pounds cousin has gone to 200 with her first, was unable to lose the weight, and is now pregnant again. She's up at 250 plus, and hates herself because of it. I was 150, now 190 post baby. My eating disorder is back with a vengeance. I refuse to be pregnant again because of the weight gain. Your husband is onto something. It might hurt now. But it'll hurt a lot more a lot longer if you get to a point where it hurts to exercise, hurts to look in the mirror, hurts your back as you bend to try and pick up your child. It's hard to hear, but you want to keep up with your children. Not losing it will make it difficult to do so. And may result in a lower lifespan. Being obese is a massive risk factor. I'm sure your husband doesn't want to raise a child alone. Truth is he wants the best long-term results for you and your family. If you're thinking about starting your weight loss journey, know that there's no magic pill, magical machine or food. It's all about calories in and out. If you manage to adapt to a diet that can provide you with a deficit in calories, you'll be able to loss weight in a reasonable amount of time. Wishing you the best to you and her family. You are pulling the I have low self-esteem therefore I eat card. Ask yourself why do I eat? Or is it just because you don't know what a healthy eating pattern is? Avoiding the word diet here. Figure that out and fix it. Your health is related to obesity and pregnancy is very important. I have a friend who got preeclampsia and ended up have several strokes immediately after giving birth to her first child and ended up in a coma for like a week. She could have died. She had serious permanent issues afterwards. 
This stuff is no joke and you should do all you can to be in the best possible health before you even consider getting pregnant again. Your husband is absolutely right. You have to accept reality and start working towards losing weight. If you show him that you are trying to lose weight then I am sure he will support in that journey. Instead of taking it as insult take it as concern for your health. E. G. What is good? Partner who doesn't say anything significant other becoming drug addict. Or partner who is strict and makes you realize and stop the drug addiction. He is scared. It sounds to me like he loves you and really cares about you. And didn't mention things to you out of respect for your feelings, but as things got worse he realized he had to say something. I think he's stuck in a really tough place. He's scared for your health. He wants to help you, but doesn't want to hurt your feelings. It's a tough place for the both of you. Don't be afraid to get help. You need it. I don't think anyone can go through weight loss propelli when they're completely alone. Don't isolate yourself. You have him and he cares for you a lot. It's important to get the encouragement and love. You deserve it. Get back in there when you're ready. You've got this, okay. I know Reddit is full of comments that say our families, partners, co-workers etc. are wrong, horrible, narcissistic and abusive. But usually our poor misguided loved ones are just like us, doing their best to love us in the only way they know how. Your hubby was very likely very scared, worried and broken hearted that something would happen to you or his child. He worried that he could lose you forever, that he would be alone in this world and face everything alone forever, including fatherhood. I promise, if he is normal, he never wants to feel like that again. He is asking you to alleviate that fear and that horrible feeling in the most heartfelt way he can. Even if he has other concerns about your weight, this is deep down in there as well. Have hope. It would be good for you to lose weight. And losing weight is actually very simple and can happen very quickly and healthily. Check out a book called The South Beach Diet Quick and Easy Cookbook by Arthur Agatston. It goes over what foods are good to eat, what foods aren't, and why. You can change your entire life in a short time just by changing what you put in your body. You can start immediately with your next grocery shopping trip. Plan and execute a new lifestyle. I eat a lot, and I eat constantly, but I'm still slim because of what I eat and how I eat. I have a healthy lifestyle. Honestly I do think he is right. I'm sorry about how this is going to feel but I think you need to hear what is best for you. I'm not gonna blow smoke up your behind. This is about him wanting the best for you. Being overweight severely affects your ability to get pregnant and then it hugely affects your ability to carry a healthy baby to term. And then after birth the weight can contribute to endless health problems, leaving him a widower and your child without a mother. This is not about him being controlling. This is not about him not loving you. This is about love and asking you to do what is needed for you to have a long and healthy life. It's entirely possible that your husband's primary concern is your health. Please seek medical advice. Good luck.